What is going on guys? It is Fatal Reaper Day, bringing you guys another video. And as I said, with this new year, we're going to have plenty of games. I'm going to start doing as many games as possible. Um, I'm still doing Roblox videos, so if you guys want to see certain Roblox games on the HP Pavilion, that's what we're doing the video on today. Um, do let me know in the comments. We are going to be doing, like I said in previous videos, some new things for the new year. We're doing some different videos, different reviews on different things. For instance, I just bought a Nintendo Switch. Probably going to do a review on that. Certain things, and we'll just try to span off and do other things on, on top of the pavilion. So I'm still doing pavilion videos, especially God of War. God of War comes out in the next week or two, and I am pre-ordering it soon, and we'll get a video up on that. So, without further ado, we are on the HP Pavilion Gaming Laptop. Uh, once again, description down below for all the hardware and stuff. 16 gigs of RAM. We are today on Star Wars Battlefront. So, I want to do a Star Wars game. I've had a lot of people actually ask me to do one before in the past. Really never thought about it. With the Steam sale, I think I think I got Battlefront here for like maybe four bucks. So, their Steam sale, if you guys haven't checked it out, I don't know when it ends, but you do want to check that out. They have a lot of good games on uh, Steam for, you know, cheap, 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 for just a few dollars sometimes. Um, this, so this is Star Wars Battlefront. This is on ultra settings. I don't know if you caught that in the very beginning of the uh, um, video. I did put the settings on ultra. So this is ultra settings. This is max settings. That is the FPS counter we're getting up there. Now, I, I have a lot of people who usually complain about the temperatures that I'm getting. Um, and I'll probably get some on this video. So all that is, that temperature up there, I realize that's kind of high. It's 99, 98. even went to 100 right there. That is just because it's on the charger. That is specifically just the charger. If I were to unplug that from the charger at the moment right now, it would go back down to 60, 60 degrees, 60 Celsius, with no, is, uh, no issues on the CPU. It's just because we've got the charger on. That's just normal. I've looked it up many times. I've done my research. It is completely normal for it to be on charger getting those temps. Now, if it were saying like 105, 110, and it was just constantly jumping to that, then you might want to worry, but I mean, we only hit 100 once for a split second, and it pretty much stays at 99, 98. That's just kind of normal what it does, and certain games cause it to do more, obviously, if it's, you know, having to run harder. That being said, the game ran smoothly. That's, that's the main thing I look at when I'm doing these videos for you guys. I look at what is the game actually running. Is it running smooth? Because, you know, forget the FPS for a minute. It don't matter if we're getting 100, 200 FPS, whatever. Well, look how smooth it's running. I had no issues with the game whatsoever, even after recording. Sometimes recordings can be jumpy and laggy. Obviously, they are recording. Shadowplay does mess up a lot that I use. Um, but that being said, no issues there. Ran smoothly. I had no issues playing it. It was just a smooth game. We got good FPS, and that is on its highest ultra settings. And obviously, you could tweak the settings to your likings if you wanted maybe some more FPS or anything like that. But the game ran smoothly, and that's what we were looking for. So another game on the list for the HP Pavilion running smoothly. If you guys have any questions, do leave me some comments down below. I'll be sure to get back to you as quick as I can. I'll try to help you out the best I can. Um, and if you have any more requests, I'm doing a lot of games and stuff like that. But I'll try to get to your requests if there are certain games. If they you know, seem like a good game to do. Or um, I can actually get them because mind you I do have to pay for these games and buy them myself So that being said guys, I hope you enjoyed this video Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe as always and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching